People gathered at McIntosh High School to mourn the murder of a Mount Vernon man. Fox 10 News reporter Katie Weiss attended that vigil this evening. She joins us now in our studio with more. Katie, how was this? It was an emotional ceremony tonight at McIntosh High School. I spoke with several family members of the victim who say he was a kind man who will never be forgotten. Friends and family say they are still in shock after 23-year-old Cortez Thomas was shot in the face late Saturday night at the Sports 43 bar, also known as Figs, to locals. Police believe he was shot by a family member during a domestic dispute, something that is appalling to other relatives. It hurts because it's like, who can you trust? Like, you, like, you know, we have the same family, and... For you to, you know, kill someone that's in your family, it hurts. Like, it's like you look up to them. Like y'all, y'all play together and all this kind of stuff. And for someone to retaliate like that. Tonight, friends and family remembered Thomas's generous personality and kind soul with a solemn candlelight vigil at Thomas's alma mater, McIntosh High School. Family members tell me he was a good man who left this earth too soon. He was a good person, good-hearted person, and uh, a good guy to hang with. You know, he never liked to, you know, be around no violence or nothing. He'll make you laugh. I mean, he just that type. Like if you're down, he'll. He's the first one to make you laugh. It's just like he was the type of person. And like everybody loved him. It's like you never met nobody who didn't love him. Yeah, Thomas lies be, it leaves behind two young children and a fiance. Funeral arrangements are set for Saturday. Bob. Thanks, Katie.